Hey guys, welcome back. Bodie 101 here, and we're back in the world of Mage Quest, picking up just a bit after we left off. So, last few episodes, we've been dedicating ourselves to the Scourge that is Thomcraft. But, I think we're going to take just a little bit of a little breaky break there and get a little bit more into the other one. This one. The, uh, watch my who's it? The guy with the with the with the hat guy, the witchy people, those ones. All right. So we did stop on this because we needed to get ourselves some mandrakes. So let's be ready. Come on, you little son of a. Come here. Come here. 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 Yeah. Uh, okay. All right. All right. We're fine. We're fine. All right. Cool. We can claim that one. Ugh. Okay. Two. Yeah, that was that was a that was a that was a thing. That was definitely a thing. All right, so let's keep moving on and get a little bit more into witchery and just kind of kind of bounce back and forth between the the two mods here. Let's see. So, all right, in order to get anywhere in this house, you're going to need the stereotypical witch's cauldron. This item, uh, this item, not only tells the rest of the world of your witchiness, they should just know. Um, but it also safely allows you allows the combination of magical items into even more powerful forms. So apparently the first part was to make a cauldron and we have one. And uh, the second one is to make anointing paste. So let's kind of look that up real quick. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. So anointing paste looks like it's just all of the seeds. What is this? Oh, yeah. All right. So let's uh, let's just come over here. I don't think I have any of the seeds. I think I planted them all. My nose itches. Okay. Uh, we got that one. And yeah. So snowbell, mandrake, and water oak artichoke. Not a problem. I think if we come out here and actually break one of the non-fully grown ones, like one of these, we should be fine. Let's go ahead and get Belladonna. Uh, okay, let's actually put one back. And then we need Snowbell, which gives us a snowball. Wait, what the hell? What's going to say? Hmm, actually... Actually, amount of seeds. Okay. All right. So we got those now. Let's go ahead and pop in here real quick, and go ahead and make this bad boy up. Oop. Oh really? Oh, oh wait. Do I? Oh, I don't have water artichoke. Did I grab one I didn't need? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, water artichoke. I forgot that one. All right. Okay, we got a water artichoke. Where the heck are the seeds? There we go. There we go. Put a couple more of these down. And now we should be good to go. All right, let's go do this. Let's make some paste for anointing, which sounds like, I don't know, if I get a burn or a cut, like your mom comes in, she's like, oh, did you cut yourself? Let's get you some anointing paste. All right. So now we just take this cauldron that we actually stole from one of the little witchy buildings out there, and boom, we did it. We did it. There we go. It gives us some iron, switchcraft, and we'll just get ourselves a reward back. All right. Sweet. All right. Let's see what we got in this old reward bag. Let's see. Um, Mob hunter. What is that? I don't know what that does. Did that do something? Well, maybe it did something. All right, whatever. <clears throat> Utandis. All right, so we're going to want Utandis. Let's actually, I'm trying to read. The realm you live in is inherently unmagical. Or at least it doesn't contain much of the magic involved in so-called witchery. Thankfully, those mandrake roots unlock the key 
to shifting objects between six planes. You just need to boot. Oh my god, this is so intriguing. Uh, boost their magical properties with the items you can. Okay, we know what it does. All right, we know what Mutandus does. All right, so first and foremost, let's go ahead. And I'm thinking like here. I'm really hoping we don't burn down our house. Let's, uh, can I put lava under it? I think I can use lava. Or does it have to be fire? You know what? I think, look at what I got there. Look at what I got. Look at that. All right. We'll do that. And then we'll grab a uh, little wicked fire starter. And then we'll do this. And we'll do that. And then we'll do this. And then what I'm thinking... Uh, we're just going to put a little water source back here, kind of like we did over here. Grab ourselves a couple buckets of water. Sweet. And... Oh, God, our house is on fire. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I should have done slaps. I should have done slaps. I... Oh, God. Yep, yep, yep. I still hear it. I still hear it. Nope. Why do I still hear it? Why do I still hear it? Okay, so um, we're going to have to do a little bit of adjusting here. Let's do that. Let's do that. And let's head over this way just for a second and grab ourselves a stack of cobble. Okay. And then let's go ahead. Do we have an axe? How do we have an axe? Why do we not have an axe? Let's go get an axe. Um, yeah, so, uh, so things happened. We're fine. Okay. And. If I made slabs, I could do it that way. But I think I'm just going to put cobble above this. I don't know how big I need to make it, so I'm going to give myself a little, a little wiggle room, if you will. Uh, we'll go one more out this way. Mm -mm 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 -mm. All right. Putting glass have a sweet sky skylight. All right. Mm -mm 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 -mm. All right. There's that, and oh, I missed. And that. Let's try this again, but maybe. Just talking crazy. Let's stay over here for a second and see how things shake out. Where's my flint and steel? There it is. Okay. Alright. Good so far. I'm a little wary. Some water in here. Okay. Just a, uh, you know, just a, just a, just a dash, just a, just a dash of fire. That's all we had. Let's go to bed and hopefully we don't die in our sleep. Let's find out. Just a dash of fire. That's all. That's all it was. Ah, but soda fixes everything. Just a dash of fire. I don't like that I can hear fire, even though it's that fire. Just for fun, let's pop up here. Let's do this, and let's put our torch back, and uh, make sure the world's not on fire. So those red flowers and freaked out for a second. I'm fine. Okay, so to make mutandus, mutandus is made with 
exile of the horn one. So we're going to need to get, and I know we have some, we have one. So we need to get some saplings going. I don't know what I just picked up. Uh, saplings. Get a few more. There we go. We'll get these cooked up because we are also going to need eggs. Let's get that out of there. Let's get that in there. All right. We also need some more clay jars. I don't think I have any more clay. So it looks like we need to go on a bit of an adventure. So we need to get eggs. Um, and we need to get some more clay. Now, this is where the issue might arise. Let's turn this off. <coughs> um, keep an eye out. I don't know if the eagles drop eggs. Um, and I... I'm, I can say I'm pretty sure that the pigs don't. Um, but I, I, you know what? You never know. I'm not a pigologist. Is that a thing? That doesn't sound right. But, you know what? I'm going to stick with it anyways. All right, let's get ourselves a butt ton of clay, and then we'll go on, our, on a fun little egg hunt. out of here because you kind of want a pretty decent amount of mutandus so you can get all the different stuff all right let's get some air okay all right so eggs now if we find a bunch of eggs we're probably going to want to try and get a get some chickens of our own um, mm, 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 mm. hi, witchy neighbor. Any eggs out here by any chance? Have you seen, perhaps, possibly, eggs? Now, we did, we did, we had to go on a chicken hunt, didn't we? Because we needed a regular feather, and chickens were not. I see a chicken over here. Okay, on this side. Hey, buddy. Can you poop out a family member for me? That'd be great. Poop it out. Do it. Do it. You stay right there. All right. So, and I, I don't think that unless the chunk is loaded for the egg, for the chickens to lay the eggs, that they'll just be sitting there. That is the tricky part. So, eh, we'll just go on an adventure, see what we can come across. You know, being a witch isn't about being like, you know, stressed out and on a clock. It's like, you know what? You do your thing. We'll do our thing. And, you know, we'll witch when it's witch time. You know what I'm saying? You don't, you don't want to force being a witch. That seems, seems like a bad idea. Now, we can get one of those pigs to lay an egg. That's going to be super handy. All right, chicken convention. Gets to making a... You know... Encased babies. Why do I need eggs? All right, come on, guys. Poop it out. Let's do this. I need... Let's see. Let's see in the book real quick. We need... We actually only need one. Oh, we get one. It'll give us 64. So we literally just need an egg. One egg. Drop one stank egg. Drop them. Drop them. Ha! I thought I could scare an egg out of them. Did I hear a little poop? Mm -mm. Still looking for chicken, but fun. Come on. You're killing me here. What's this box? You guys, I'll leave you guys alone while I go deal with this box, and then you guys can uh, 
Give me your uh, stuff. Uh, right, there's one. Done. Um, I don't know what these things are, but I feel I should grab them. All right, chickens, come on, give. And I bet you I have an egg at home. Is that a feather? I don't need a feather. I need an egg. Come on. I know one of you guys have dropped at least one. Stop with the feathers. What, what, are, you, what are you, molting? Come on. How about over here? Come on, you're my guy. Or girl. Hand it up. Hand it up. Who's my hand? What, what? Come on. Where's my hand at? You're embarrassing me in front of the viewers. Do it. Get in that hole. Get in that hole and make, make little children's. Get in there. Do it. A watched head never boils. Or, what? Not boils. That seems weird. I'm telling you right now, chickens, if one of these cows has an egg before you, oh, we are going to have trouble. Stop with the feathers already. How about you, sheep? Any sheep eggs? Nope. You know, I never usually listen for the little pop sound of them laying an egg. But I'm just so intently listening to it. Come on! Oh my, I've gotten four feathers. Four, have I gotten an egg? No, four feathers. If I have an egg at home, I'm going to feel stupid. Uh, let's go see what's going on over here. I don't even care about your eggs. I'm just going to leave. I'm not really going to. I'm just going to look at this and we're going to go back. Oh, there's chickens over here. Feathers. Well, I've found Chicktopia, apparently. The, the the land of a thousand chickens. So many feathers. Are you all dudes? What's going on? I will get an egg out of a male chicken if I have to. Squeeze it out. Come on, you this is this is Chicktopia. You're supposed to like help help out a bearded brother out. Let's do this. Snore a node right there. Chickens laying eggs, you they are. I'm running, come on. You're making me feel stupid, you are. There seriously has to be one why Chicktopia sucks. If you guys are planning like a vacation, like with the family, don't go visit Chicktopia. Oh! High five, buddy. Oh, crap, sorry. All right. Oh, look. When it rain... Are you serious? When it rains, it pours eggs, apparently. I think this is some sort of Mojang joke. They're like, watch this. What is this? What are we, what is this? Why? Why is this here? All right. Let's head home real quick. Ow. And we are coming up to the end of this episode. But before we go, we're going to get this. Uh, maybe not. Uh, crap. All right, let me just put these things in here. You can go in there and whatever all right so now move and move so we need this and this all right so we toss this in and then we wait for the magic to happen kazam totally kazam that all right so it takes you what really all right guys hope you enjoyed the episode if you did make sure you hit that thumbs up questions comments concerns put it down in the comment section and if you're having egg problems head over to aim the game at least you can get all your minecraft server problems taken care of there get all set up have some fun have some good times and until the next just 
finding a new way to frustrate the hell out of me episode of Mage Quest. I want to thank you guys so much for hanging out. See you guys next time. Bye!